Look at you guys, just sitting there, waiting for springtime. Wow, you hear that noise in the background? That's me getting unloaded. Right here, I'm getting unloaded here in Minneapolis, Minnesota. Welcome everybody to another daily vlog, a chilly daily vlog. It is 11 a.m., minus seven degrees, I think is what it just said before I turned you guys on. It said minus seven degrees, and guess what? Guess what? I'm in shorts. No, I'm not lying. I do have a jacket on, but shorts, and I don't have my flip-flops on. No, it's a little bit too cold for that. But I'm getting unloaded here real fast. I'm gonna head down to a little town called Gaylord, Minnesota, pick up a load. I thought I was gonna be heading out to Florida, back home. No, that's not gonna happen, but they are sending me to a warmer state. A warmer state than this. Georgia, I get to go to Atlanta, Georgia, to Six Flags. I'm picking out a load of food or something to go over to Six Flags in Atlanta, which is kind of weird because I don't think the theme park even opens up for a couple more months. They usually close down during the winter time. So maybe they're just stocking up. I'm not exactly sure what I'm getting. I am picking up Hormel, so it's some sort of meat product, and meat doesn't last a few months, unless it's Hormel. You guys don't believe it's cold? Look at this, this guy just parked. He just parked. And already, there's icicles hanging off of his tire. He just backed in beside me, it didn't take very long. It is definitely too cold to build a snowman. But I was wrong about the temperature. It was seven. It was minus seven degrees. But I just got back in my truck. It's warmed up a little bit. You guys can see it, but right here, right there, it says minus one degree. So it has warmed up a little. When a lot of people come up north, I mean way up north like this, they expect to see a lot of pine trees and forests like that, a lot of evergreens. But it's not like that here, especially in Wisconsin and Minnesota. You'll get the occasional evergreen, but most of the time, no, you won't see them. Wow. Stay. Okay, wow. Yeah, I put my flip-flops on, walked across the snowy tundra to grab a shower. So flip-flops, swim trunks, sub-zero temperatures. Check this out, ready? Well, it's starting to thaw out. I got the heater blast in here. That one's still ice. My hair was rock solid. I only walked about 50 yards. Wet hair, and, you know, up here probably did not freeze. But down here, it froze, and in here, turned to ice. Just in a 50-yard walk. Insane. I am so lucky. Whoa, 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 camera. Whoa, you're going all nuts. You're going crazy, camera. You guys are so lucky that I didn't bring you with me just now. I'm telling you. There is a thing called freezing rain, freezing ice, something. I don't know. That's what's happening right now. So what I did is I went in, I love this, I love this thing connected to my cell phone, but uh, yeah, there's a freezing rain, so what's happening is there's a mist, a rain, and it falls, but the ground is colder than the air, so whatever hits the ground just turns to solid ice. I mean, you can't drive on it, and uh, I'm proof that you can't walk on it. <laughs> it's, I just stopped here to eat breakfast. I was thinking about taking you guys into the restaurant. I'm so happy I didn't. Though I'm old, I can still fall down as well as a young person and not get injured. I was pretty happy about that. I walked away with minimal injuries other than a, well, no, I may be wrong. Just slight injuries. Nothing too bad. Nothing that is gonna stop me from going down the road and getting out of this damn weather.
But if I would have brought you guys along with me, my telephone, the Osmo Mobile, everything would have probably been smashed because like in, when I was younger and used to go roller skating at the roller rinks and when I'd fall, I'd put my hands out and hit my palms and get that stinging sensation, but I really wouldn't get injured. If I would have did that just now, because that's how I fell, you guys would have went flying. So I'm really glad I decided to leave you guys in the truck. Wow, this is going to be a crazy day of driving. So I'm probably just going to cruise in today's video and uh, hopefully make it down to Georgia safely. So until the next one, guys, I love you all. Peace out.